You have a layer mapping property assessment values in the town of Portage La Prairie in Manitoba, Canada. You want to visualize the total value field on a map in ArcGIS Online. On the Settings toolbar, click Styles, click Field, and choose Total Value. Only two styles are available for this field. You hoped to use a quantitative style such as counts and amounts size, but none are available because total value is a string or text field. Numeric values are required to use the counts and amounts style. It won't work with text values. To get around this problem, you will use an arcade expression to convert the text values into numeric values. Remove the field and click the Expression button. In the Expression Builder window, expand the toolbar. Click Functions and search for Number. The list filters to one function. Number is the name of the function. Value and pattern are its two parameters. The question mark indicates that pattern is an optional parameter. The text at the end indicates that the output of this function will be a number. You'll use this function to convert the text values stored in the total value field into numeric values. Click the number function. It appears in the expression builder. The value parameter is highlighted. You'll replace it with the total value field. Click profile variables. Click the arrow next to dollar sign feature. A list of all of the fields from the layer appears. Click the total value field. The expression updates. The first parameter, value, is now defined as dollar sign feature dot total value. The expression will access the total value attribute from each feature in the layer. The next parameter, pattern, is optional, so you'll run the expression to test if it works without it. Click run. The output is number NAN, which stands for not a number. The expression did not work with an undefined pattern. In the expression, after the first parameter, add the text comma quote number sign dot number sign number sign quote. The pattern you typed will convert any amount of digits before the decimal and up to two digits after the decimal. The values in the total value field are monetary, so there's a possibility that some may be expressed with up to two decimal places. This pattern will ensure that values with decimal places can be converted. Click Run. The output doesn't change. You recall from the attribute table that each number in the total value field was prefaced with a dollar sign. This is a text character. The expression is failing because it can't convert the dollar sign into a number. You'll consult the number function's documentation to see if there's a way to remove the dollar sign character. In the function pane, click the arrow button next to the number function. The second example shows how to ignore certain characters when converting text to numbers. In the example expression, ABC and DEF are defined as text that should be ignored. You'll use this pattern to ignore the dollar sign character. In the expression, before the first number sign, add a dollar sign. Click Run. The output is number 85200. The expression was successful in converting values like $85,200 into numbers like 85200. The expression is complete. Change its name to Total Value Numeric. Click Done. The Styles pane lists the total value numeric expression as the chosen attribute. Counts and amount size has been selected as the default style for the numeric values returned by the expression. The map visualizes the values from the total value field with larger circles for larger assessed property values. In this tutorial, you learned how to use the arcade number function to convert text values to numeric values for a layer in a map, so you could apply the counts and amounts style. The expression you wrote can also be used to format pop-ups and labels.